Hello, here I am again in the same place I was a year ago. Uh, I left uh, Victoria Point uh, two days ago, sailed the first leg which was to Redcliffe, same as last year, and uh, anchored against or tied up against the pars for the night and then uh, I left there at about six in the morning and uh, sailed as far as Double Island Point, that is a uh, about 95 nautical miles. Today I'm going to cross the bar. There's a fair bit of swell running out there today so I've taken the precautions. I've uh, locked all my lockers, front hatch is locked, I'll lock the main hatch and I'll have a life jacket on as I go over the bar. It's, uh, it's quite a large bar here in White Bay Bar and uh, I always worry about it. I don't like crossing bars and this is one of the worst along the coast, uh, for me anyway. So I'll uh, head off now. Beautiful uh, place in here, lovely anchorage at the moment with the southeaster blowing. And uh, I arrived here at two in the morning. There were uh, four boats in the bay this morning. Most have uh, headed off and gone over the Wide Bay Bar. I'm uh, just about to head off. You know, to go over the bar is about a mile stretch, so it's uh, you get a few uh, breaking waves for about a mile. Okay, well, uh, maybe we'll see a few, I don't know. Yeah, this boat came in this morning, about uh, just on daylight. He, uh, he must have sailed on through the night from Malula Bar. I was thinking of doing that, going into Malula Bar, but getting up again at uh, two in the morning to sail here was uh, not very appealing, really. Commence my run in. I've uh, been going about 20 minutes over the bar. You know, over this side you can see uh, there's a sandbar over here with breakers breaking. Uh, it looks pretty good where I am at the moment. Uh, there's a lead light ahead, but I'm going to a point that the VMR has given me, and uh, I can just see the sandbank ahead. I'm just going to have to avoid. Inskip Point. It's a beautiful place to camp. Uh, come with your caravan or your tent and camp here and uh, there's, there's quite good fishing. 20 odd years ago I used to come up here with my wife and we used to come up here with a ute, drive along the uh, beach from Noosa over past Double Island Point into Rainbow Beach and then uh, camp here. 
and uh, the fishing was great and it's uh, quite calm. Yeah, from Brisbane in those days, we used to be able to pack, uh, finish work at 3.30, get the car, uh, the ute ready, full of gear, by four and be off. And we used to be up here by, uh, in the dark and pitch the tent and uh, by Saturday morning everything was, we could have two days of peace up here. After leaving Inskip Point we uh, sailed on till about 8 o'clock in the evening and uh, the wind had died out so we anchored just before Gary's anchorage. Uh, next day I set off, it was fairly cold in the morning so we waited till the sun had rose a bit and about 9 o'clock we set off and uh, sailed on down just under the jib doing about two, two and a half knots uh, all the way down here to uh, Mackenzie Jetty which is just before Kingfisher Bay. Mackenzie Jetty was where they uh, trained the troops in the war. There's Mackenzie Jetty, it's just the uh, remnants of it now, 